Most political parties in this election say, give us your constituency vote, but also vote for us on the list. Mm. In the SNP's case, they got over 118,000 list votes here in Edinburgh Central at the last election, and they got zero list MSPs uh, elected. So is it not a waste of time? I think it is deeply insulting to voters to describe any vote as a wasted vote. No vote is a wasted vote, but particularly in this context, uh, you cannot be certain when you walk into a polling station that your preferred SNP candidate is going to win the constituency and therefore you can vote for somebody else with your list vote. If you start to vote for parties other than the SNP uh, with either of your votes, what you do is reduce the chances of an SNP government. And we don't really just need to talk about that theoretically. If you look at 2011 and 2016, 2011 the SNP won a majority, in 2016 we fell just short. What was the difference in these two elections? In the first one, where we got the majority, there was very narrow gap between our constituency and our list percentage share of the vote. It was bigger in 2016. What happened? We fell short of a majority. So if you want an SNP government, if you want to re-elect me as First Minister, if you want to re-elect me as First Minister and re-elect the SNP, both votes SNP, is the only way to put that beyond any doubt. Anything else is taking a chance and at this time in particular such a serious time to be living through you don't want to take a chance on who governs the country